you don't even care. You just want some love. What's that? I got some snacks. Oh, who's it? His ears. His ears. Despite the large numbers of homeless animals in Chicago, there are still organizations or people who are willing to help them. The Anti Cruelty Society is one of the organizations. Anti Cruelty Society is more than just an animal shelter; it's a home for warm and love. I'm Bridget Bittman. I'm the marketing and communications director at the Anti Cruelty Society. The Anti Cruelty Society is. Chicago's oldest private animal welfare organization. We were founded back in 1899, and、uh, a woman named Rose Faye Thomas, along with four other women, decided to form the organization to care for the horses and other animals they deserve more humane treatment. And we do thousands of adoptions of cats, dogs, and small animals every year. Our small animals vary from mice and domestic rats to rabbits and guinea pigs and hamsters. I personally really enjoy and support the mission of the Anti Cruelty Society, which is to help pets and people thrive. And it's not just the animals that are part of our organization; it's the people as well. So the people that own the pets. Are genuinely interested in, in caring for their pets, and if they need extra help, we're there to do that. Just being able to find as many homes for animals that really have had a rough start in life. Sometimes they come to us because an owner has passed away, or perhaps there's a cruelty or neglect case, and they've been surrendered or given up by their owners. And we're here to make sure that those animals, whether it's a cat or a dog, A kitten, a puppy, or perhaps a guinea pig, receives the food, medical care, and attention, exercise, and actual interaction to help them have the best life here at the shelter, and then the best life in a home with someone who can adopt them. But at the end of the day, I get satisfaction knowing that I've helped lots of animals. Find homes as well as find solace where people care about them, and there's so many animals that are found on the streets of Chicago or in areas where they're being mistreated. And we know that we're a safe place, and we're always an open door to compassion for any animal that needs our help. We don't turn animals away. For Bridget, what she gains from working here is not only the sense of achievement of rescuing animals, but also the love between people and animals.